Hi friends, uh, welcome to TechLeck video tutorials. Uh, this session I am going to explain about uh, cardinality. Like most of the SQL or PL SQL developers, uh, while doing the performance tuning or while creating indexes, you will uh, get an idea or maybe you will get doubts on cardinality. So, exactly what is cardinality? Like if you are going for performance tuning or if you are going for creating a bitmap or B3 indexes. So, you will get a little bit. Uh, uh, like a uh, confusion on uh, cardinality. So I, I'm going to explain about the cardinality. Like if you are doing a execution plan, like if you look at this, you can see here there is a cardinality seven tool. So cardinality means your records on your this table. Like if you are going for more than one table, uh, like whatever you have doing multiple join conditions, that time how many records you can expect. So uh, if you are doing execution plan. Uh, always uh, you won't get a hundred percent expecting records, but uh, you should know uh, what is the cardinality first. Then you will get more clarity on that. If you look at this diagram, I have a table like you can say employee table or you can say any customer table. Uh, ID uh, like any table will have ID right, unique ID. So this ID is unique. There is no uh, duplicate records. And then name name you can expect the same name. For example. If you are looking at some company uh, employees, so same employee will be there, like same employee name will be there for uh, multiple employees, but their employee ID is different, maybe their first name or maybe last name or their surname is different, but their ID is, uh, is unique always. So whatever you can see the unique records, unique records, number of total records, that is called high cardinality, that is called high cardinality. Like if you look at email, email address also you can't create a duplicate mail ID. For example, employee ID uh, address or if you are going for Gmail address or if you any company address, you can't create a duplicate IDs. That is, you can't create a duplicate ID addresses. So that is called, it is always unique. Those are related to high cardinality. High cardinality means number of records and uh, total number of records is same for the entire table. That is called high cardinality. And if you look at addresses, if you look at addresses and names, so some people will uh, will have a same address, some people will have a different addresses, so some people will have a same name. So like those related information, you can say normal cardinality. Okay, normal cardinality. So what about the low cardinality means? If you look at status like uh, active or inactive or material status married or unmarried uh, like uh, sex male or female so this type of information like those are related to low cardinality those are related to low cardinality if you look at phone numbers also is high cardinality phone numbers also high cardinality why because uh, it is also unique phone numbers also is always unique so this is related to cardinality High cardinality means it should be unique records. It should be unique records. Normal cardinality means you may expect some of repeated data. That is a normal cardinality. Low cardinality means it will be there like us repeated values. Repeated values means like stated fla status flags, material status like married or unmarried, like uh, sex, um, uh, male or female. This related information you can call as low cardinality information. Like when, when you are going for doing a performance tuning, when you are going for performance tuning, like as you know that uh, you will be creating indexes, bitmap and B3 indexes. So most of the interviewers you will get confused like uh, while doing interviews. So you will get uh, confused on answering what uh, when will go for bitmap index, when we will go for B3 index. Okay. So if you have a high cardinality, if you have a high cardinality, that time will go for B3 index. Bitmap index means if you have a low cardinality. As you know that uh, bitmapping zeros and ones, the background structure uh, Oracle engine will identify that. So if you have a two records here, you can see here unique is two only, uh, active and inactive. So that is called we will be creating bitmap index on this low cardinality column. So it will improve the better performance. Uh, most of the people will get confused on that uh, uh, you can't create a bitmap indexes on uh, OLTP systems. So because uh, most of the people will get answer on like uh, 
bitmap indexes will be historical records huge data that is a huge duplicate records means it is not duplicate records it is like status or material status or sex this type of information that time only will go for bitmap index okay that time will go for bitmap index huge duplicate record that was repeated records okay but here if you are going for names or if you are going for address that those also duplicate records some duplicate records you can expect that but that is those uh, columns you can't create always uh, uh, bitmap index so this is the major uh, information related to cardinality so thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel to get more videos and updates my channel thank you very much